Well, let's talk uh, about um, Watteau, La Partie Carré. The foursome, party of four, actually it has that resonance. Right. Two couples in theatrical costume in a park. There, there's a flirty, uh, gallant sense to this picture. But what are they dressed as? These are, they're, they're not dressed in contemporary costume. They are wearing theatrical costume, the costume of the fair theater, the Commedia dell'arte, the clowns and blackguards that cavorted on stage. And Vato took that rather brash theatrical world and poetized it. He brings it into an aristocratic garden. We have these beautiful young women. The man who's back to us is Piero, the foolish clown, but he's not really foolish here. He's, we don't, to, to see him from the back with his guitar hanging, we don't know what he's thinking. We, we sense that he is hoping that something will develop with, the, with one of these two lovely women. And these two young women are, are attentive to him and the, the other gentleman is, is uh, sitting off to the side. Uh, I think we've all been there, actually. <laughs> I, think, I think that, in a way, Vato captures something of how is, this, how is this going to work out. And because he's a very learned artist and a very sophisticated artist, when we look in the landscape, we see these putti, these little angels on a dolphin. It's a garden piece of garden statuary. That is also a symbol for expectant desire, desire held in check. The dolphin wants to move forward the Puti love, love images are holding him back for the moment. And in a way, it, it, it resonates with what's playing out in this scene. And Vata would have hoped that his audience would have understood that.